question for you. What's special here? What's special about it? So why are you coming back? You asking me, you're a Filipina, Deba. Yeah, I'm a Filipina, but you're a foreigner. I know what's here in the Philippines. But you, what do you found here in the Philippines that keeps you coming back? The special thing is, I'm going to tell you this, and uh, probably no, not many people understand that it's the people here that makes it special, you know? Yeah, you, you, connect, you connect to the people, and they are so friendly, and everywhere you go, they say hello, or how are you? That's what's good about the Philippines, I think. Yeah. That, that, that is so special about the Philippines. That makes it different to so many other places. Yeah. I would yeah, I would write that as the people is anyway, the people makes the country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But do you got a uh, a place that's most memorable for you? Well, you know, the Philippines has got over, what, 7,000 islands? And everywhere you go, you have a memory because it's everything's different here. And you've got different um, languages. You know, got, what, how many? Is there 57? Or I don't know how many dialects they have. Dialects. Yeah, there's so many. And that, you know, you, you go to a another city or another island and you learn something different and everything's different the nature of it and uh, the people are all different you know yeah that's what that's my perspective but i'm no expert but, but do you got a uh, place specific place one place that makes you want to go back at that place i always give you a happy <laughs> What's your favorite Why does it always have to come down to that in the Philippines? Why do they talk about the, the heroes of you? On Monday, you have a holiday here. Do any of you know what the holiday on Monday is? Who knows what the holiday on Monday is? It's Heroes Day. Rizal, Bonapatio, the Bogos Brothers, Gabriela Silon. What, is, what has happened to the Philippines? In 1890, you had kicked the Spanish's ass. Yes! Okay? And you got hoodwinked by the Americans because the Spanish did not want to lose face because they lost control of the whole country. And the only part that they controlled was Manila. <laughs> so they saved their face by selling the Philippines to America for $10 million. 50 pieces of gold. And do you think, where do you think that $50 million, uh, 50 pieces of gold is now? It's in the pockets of a lot of people that don't live here anymore. <laughs> and the winner is... Da -da -da -da. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Yeah. Thumbs up. Cheers to Jeff. Okay. Thank you.